Okay, so we're back on the road again. This is the second video of our UK tour, and today we're driving up towards Northumberland. Have you seen outside of the window? Look! What is it? What is um, it? Three castles. Three castles. Where did they go? Two, three, boom! <laughs> Get them out of there! Where? There you are! Did you see the lion, Luke? Look at the lion! Yeah. Are you dead as I think it's in? about um, maybe yeah. 14 degrees or 13 degrees, so it's quite chilly. We're going to find our camper van parked right outside the entrance, which is quite lucky. No, that's right! Where's the castle? There's the castle. That is a big castle. It is a big castle. And we get, and we get. The castle is so big up high. And what, what lives in there? The castle in the man. In the man? Oh, wow. Okay, so we were just driving around for a while trying to find somewhere to park and um, it was actually quite hard to find a parking space because obviously our camper is quite long and uh, we pulled into a farmer's field actually just to turn around and he came out and said that he allows camper vans to park in his field and it's only 10 pounds a night so although most of the time we tend to opt for wild camping we thought well actually if we find a car park it's probably going to cost us at least six pounds to park anyway so for ten pounds we get to top our water up we get to um, get rid of our chemical toilet waste and we get a camping space for the night as well so here's our camper van oh here's Leo hi Leo Leo where's the beach yeah there's the beach just there oh mama is coming so we've got quite a nice view. Where are we going, Leo? We're going to the sand. We're going to the sand. The sand looks quite nice just over there, so um, we're we'll going to have a look. What is it? That's a shell. <laughs> this is shell. Do you think that's a shell? Do you want to pick it up? What is it? Yeah, that's a crab shell. A crab shell? Do you want to pick it up? Yeah. Hi. For Leo? Do you go and find some more? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let's go find some more cells. Okay. Sell my pockets. Dada. Sell my pockets. Have you got it? Yeah. Sell my pockets. That's great. Yeah. Are you happy? Yeah. There. Look, it's That's a shell. Oh no, it's hidey, hidey, hidey. Oh, where's it gone? No. That's a stone. That, that's a stone. You can hear the sea over there. Yeah, you can hear it breaking. You can do it. Careful. Careful. It's so Oh, it's made it. You made it. So we've been parked at this campsite now for two nights. We originally intended just to stay for the one night, but um, the whole of yesterday it was raining and there's a massive hill that we need to drive up to get out of here. There were quite a few other camper vans and things um, slipping back down the, uh, the hill. So we decided to wait an extra day um, so that we could drive out. We're hoping to get out of here today and um, we're gonna go up and see Bamber Castle close up and also Lindisfarne as well. Well, that was a good effort, but uh, we didn't quite make it up the hill, so we're just going to wait for the tractor to pull us um, up and then hopefully we can get out. I'm going to find the towing ring and see if I can attach it. Now, let's see. 
Where's that towing eye? Yeah. <laughs> but the cavalry is here, so we're going to give it a go. Um, apparently, this tiny little Jeep is amazing at pulling things out of this field, so we will see. Here we go. Oh, so far, so good. I'm very surprised that that little Jeep can pull the weight of this camper van up there. It's doing well. It's doing very well. Not the most dignified way to leave a campsite, but unfortunately our camper van is uh, so heavy and with it being front wheel drive as well, when it comes to going uphill in the wet, it's not so great. It's fantastic at driving on motorways, but it's definitely not an off-road vehicle by any means. I think we've made it on solid ground. I've got to tell you, I'm quite amazed that that little Jeep did that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Did it? <laughs> What is it? It's a big giant castle. Yeah, should we go and see it? Yeah. It's up there, that way. Okay, let's go and find it. That way. Yeah. Yeah. It's like he's running everywhere because he's so excited. <laughs> oh no. And? Castle is not up a hill. Yes, it is. Look around. Dada, Let's have a look. Yeah. Let's see what I've you got. got. A couple. I'll try to get. There's a couple more over oh. there. Look. Oh. Well. Blackberries. Yeah. Do you want to try one? Yeah. Yeah. You want to try one? Yeah. Look. Yeah. Which one do you like? Black. Black one. Put it in the mouth. You gonna eat one? Mmm. Is it nice? Mm. Would you like another? Yummy. One? <gasps> that, that's better. Uh huh. You made it through! Boo! Boo! Hi! You're gonna hide it again! Go on uh -huh. then! Giving the game away. Bye! <laughs> go, go, go! <laughs> Boo! <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? I think we're ready. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so um, we are now driving from um, the mainland in Northumberland over to an island called Lindisfarne, which is also known as Holy Island. Um, but we've only got a couple of hours to do it because the tide comes in and covers the road. So uh, yeah, we need to make a move fairly swiftly to get onto the island in time. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be quite a nice experience driving over a road that's only exposed um, above sea level for a couple of hours every day. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be fun, let's do it. Right next to the road. So 
but here we go. We're, wow. we're driving over the road that's usually covered in sea. Seaweed, it's got seaweed on it. Over to Holy Island. Yeah, we're just um, going to leave the island, but uh, everybody else is leaving at the same time, so this should be interesting. So we're just running over to the camper van to uh, turn the gas off and uh, unlock because we've only got about 20 minutes now to get off the island before the tide comes in. Okay, so we've just literally run back to our camper van because the tide is coming in very soon and we need to get off the island, otherwise we're stuck here for six hours. It's not the worst place in the world to be stuck, but uh, we want to hit the road and try and head towards Edinburgh this afternoon. So uh, we'd rather not be driving at night if possible. So uh, here we are, we're joining the rest of uh, the traffic. I think most people have got the same idea as us. There are a few other people turning up but um, yeah, I think most people are leaving the island now. So uh, let's hit the road and uh, go.